We got invited on a trip to Colombia. First destination we flew into was Medellin. That's the second biggest city in Colombia. From there, we were gonna go to Cali, which is the third biggest city. But on the way, we decided to stop in a few small towns and see what we could find, meet up with some local dudes. For me, this was my first trip in South America. People seemed to be really friendly. We didn't have too much problems finding spots to skate. All the locals were just great vibes like you'd get anywhere else with skaters. I was like going in blind. I had no idea about Colombia. I mean, it's amazing. Skating's big here, good spots. We didn't have one problem during the whole trip. Not that I was expecting that we would have problems, but you know, just touring in a foreign country, you, you could always run into problems. We haven't ran into one at all. Some parts of the cities were pretty crusty, but I mean, you could still skate them. Oh, the Pablo Escobar spot? Basically, it's a bump to rail down the street where Pablo Escobar died. It's literally a block, two blocks away. And then there's a bunch of history down the street. Most of the spots in Colombia were definitely like unique, interesting. They just look really good on film and they're super unique in their own way. The crew that we were traveling with is very diverse. We're all from different cities or countries. It's super rad. We all skate different. Oh, with Thynan? It's amazing. You know, he's real mellow. He's a good person to travel with. He has this gift of sleeping wherever, whenever. <laughs> I wish I had on the, you know, the long car rides. Angelo, that boy has a bright future, man. He's super funny. His English is getting there. What trick you got next? What? No English. No English. Camilo, fucking Nolly Flip Master. He wasn't even just a local showing us around. He was killing all the spots harder than us, dude.
the drive from Medellin to Salento, it was intense. It was like a three hour drive, a two way highway in the mountains. You know, just passing trucks on the highway around turns. But I mean, our driver was G as shit, dude. I've been to a lot of different houses, but that was definitely in the top two houses I've ever experienced being in my life. From all the way you could see to the left to all the way to the right was just green valley, epic sunset. I don't know, it could get much better than that. 